Hello there. Wow. Perfect. Wonderful. Well done. Okay. Here we go. The Waddleys helped you open the gate that was blocking your way, head into the stage, and challenge the boss that's guarding this territory. Alrighty. So we're skipping those, like, kind of side rift things. Uh, hopefully, similar to in the, dem in the demo, um, the Brawl at the Mall has, uh... You know, a section where you can pick whatever power-up you want. Now, in the demo, I did actually... I did use, uh the ice cap once. So, there he is. It's looking like the demo a lot, which means these bananas are over here. And that should mean there are power-ups right over here, question mark? Like, pick your favorite? Yeah, here we go. So there's ice cap, bomb cap, sword cap. I'm gonna go with Bomb Cap. Alright, Bomb Cap Kirby. Hey, stupid monkey! <laughs> yeah, grab the bomb! I wish you could do that. I wish you, this would... I wish it would've just blown up on his arm. Insta-kill. All right, here we go. The strong-armed beast. So after we beat this, we are officially beyond anything that uh, was in the demo. Oh, yeah, I forgot. You gotta run up on him. And he starts doing... Okay, no, not yet. So he starts doing some spin move when you hit halfway mark, I think, right? boy Ooh He got me <clears throat> He's not doing the spin move I expected him to do Ow, oh, he is smacking me around though Here comes the spin move. He landed right on my bomb. Which I'm not complaining about, obviously. Stay as far away from this guy as possible. And now he's all tuckered out. And we start rolling bombs in there. Have him jump on a bomb or two. Ooh! Come on, baby. Ooh! It's got... S I got the power-up smacked out of me there. Which leads me to the question, if I didn't have a power-up right now... Oh, God, that was a terrible idea to take flight. You just gotta run, dude. So if I didn't have a power up right there, uh, oh yeah, there he is. Jumped right onto my bomb for the final blow. Uh, can you inhale this guy? Can you inhale him and spit him out a couple of times to, you know, deal damage? Or is that just a, a blunder? Are you just screwed if 
you know, you lose your power up by any means during that fight. All right, stage clear. <clears throat> Slipped through his legs. All right, so the first world is clear now. The brawl at the mall, and we have officially surpassed all levels that were contained uh, in the demo. Waddle D Town. <clears throat> So here, <clears throat> here in Waddle D Town, there should be something that I can punch in secret passcodes to. And I have two secret passcodes that I received during uh, playing the demo. The Waddle Dees are rebuilding their town. Save as many as you can to open up new buildings and helpful resources. Let me just refresh YouTube Studio here. Alright, so we got a, a Waddle Dee Cinema is now open. Rewatch some memorable scenes on the big screen. I dig that. There's a gotcha machine. Volume 1 is now available. Turn the crank to get a figure. Try to collect the whole set. Okay. A power-up shop, I imagine. Weapon shop, yeah. Make your copy abilities even stronger. Oh, yeah, so you can go there to evolve uh, copy, copy abilities. The copy, the evolved um, bomb copy ability is so overpowered. You can, like, daisy chain bombs together. Oof. It's beautiful. Let me... Let me run over here and just get this real quick. I just saw that over there and I felt like I needed to get it. So first stop is definitely going to be the weapon shop. See if I can evolve my copy abilities. <laughs> Welcome to Waddle Dee's weapon shop. I work with all types of copy abilities. It's kind of my thing. Any copy abilities you find out there... Uh, will become available in here. Pop in and grab one anytime. Oh, and guess what else? I can help you evolve those abilities to make them much stronger. This blueprint contains some incredible techniques. We can use it to evolve your ability. Let's try evolving one right now. I'll ready my tools. Yes. Evolved bomber ability. No. No. The cutter ability can be evolved into... Yeah, that's actually garbage. I don't want to do that, though. Oh, okay, so I get to choose, I think, right? <laughs> Oh, those are the only two? But I want this one! I want this one! Evolve that one! Alright. Well, I'll evolve this one, I guess. <laughs> okay. So that's where the rare, uh... The rare stones come into play. Got it. Yeah, but I don't have the money. I don't have the rare stone to do it. I bet this one's only one required. Oh, wait. Now, all of a sudden, I have two? Or three? It just gave me two freebies to... Because I was incompetent. Oh, yeah. Volcano fire. <laughs> Success, all done. The fire ability has evolved into volcano fire. If you find more blueprints, just bring them to me. I'll use them to evolve your abilities even further. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Sorry, I killed him. He's not evolving anything now. <clears throat> I murdered him in cold blood. When you're ready to explore some more, just hop onto the Warp Star and fly to the new area. Alright, let's go, Elfin. I'm ready to explore more. I got my, uh, evolved fire ability now. My volcano fire. <laughs> Ever Bay Coast. So it's like the same music, the same like theme music, but now it's like has like a tropical vibe to it. You defeated the boss and opened up a new area. Abandoned beach. Okay.
Let's jump into abandoned beach. I feel like this isn't going to bode well for uh, the fact that I'm a volcano. Lot, it's a lot of water is all I'm saying. A lot of water for a guy who relies on fire to land attacks. But then again, this dude is over here blazing it, so why not? Got a baby bottle? Is that what that was? I didn't mean to hit that crab, but it was kind of in my way. really is a beautiful game, though. Let me get this gator quick. Where is it at? Okay, so the gator can't be... The gator can't get got. I don't know where I'm going. Sure, okay. So I think this, I think I know the answer to this already. Ooh, wild bonkers. Volcano fire, OP. Ow. Freaking wild bonkers, dude. Oh god, he's like... Wild Bonkers is... No more. I was saying, I'm just gonna add an insult to injury. Do I do Bonker? Strong style Bonker? No. I don't really want that, I just wanted to collect it. So that it'll be in my weapon shop. I just wanted to catalog it. <laughs> I think that's how that works. It's like a, wheel, a weird, like... Seal beetle? It's interesting. <laughs> Ladder. Another seal beetle. Get that. Oh, crap. I'm gonna need that. I'm gonna need that big boy bonker, aren't I? Where's the big boy bonker? It's still back here? I say probably not. You stay right there. I know you're not going to, but... I don't want to get stuck with this big boy bonker. Get this Waddle D quick, and then I'm gonna sprint back and hope. Hope that my, uh. Volcano fire is still there. It won't be, but. Sad noises! Oh, wait, but wasn't there, um. Yeah, it was gonna say. There we go. Beautiful. Sad noises. <laughs> Swim. Oh, I didn't even realize Kirby does get the little raft when he jump in the water. Look at him; he's so adorable. Anyway, I learned the other day that Kirby was actually named after, I think a guy named, like, I think his name was, like, John Kirby. He was actually Nintendo's lawyer uh, during some kind of lawsuit. I don't remember exactly the details, but that's what, that's how Kirby got his name. Again, don't quote me. I don't remember the details of it. Uh, but yeah, 
I don't know. I don't know if his name was actually John Kirby. Oh, jeez. Oh my god. Why do I feel like this gator's got to be bonked? Or just avoided, maybe. I don't know. Avoidance seems um, like always a pretty solid tactic. Let's see if I can drop a bomb. Can I get far enough back that I can just lob a firebomb and hit this guy down there? No. I gotta jump down there. And... There we go. That's what I was aiming for. Okay. Calm yourself. Oh, jeez. I'm, I'm not going to miss my opportunity to get this stuff just for this freaking one coin. But I was being greedy and I really wanted that one coin. It's going to bug me if I didn't get it. Uh, these waterfalls look suspicious. Anything behind them? No? Okay, the waterfalls looked sus, but they're not sus. So we'll continue. Mouthful mode. We got ring Kirby. Ring mouth Kirby. <laughs> oh, that's pretty nifty. <laughs> kind of difficult to aim, if I'm being honest. There we go. Haven't found any abilities that are able to uh, conquer the gators yet, though. The gators are, at this point, untouchable. They're just something you avoid. Oh, we got a boat! Oh boy, dude. Skirt! Oh. Ooh! We got a gator. I feel like Boat Kirby is a very easy way to uh, accidentally slow down and kill yourself. There's something over there, but I'm not willing to go over there to get it, I don't think. Oh, wait, there's... Oh, wait, that that's the end. Let me... Before I end the level, let me, uh... I'm gonna go over here. I saw a bowl. How do I... How do I un... How do I unboard? <laughs> oh, wait, you know what? Oh, A towards land. Ow, dude. Makes you overconfident, this freaking wind tunnel Kirby. Wind windbag Kirby. <laughs> oh, you know what? I didn't even have to get back on my boat. Alright, Windbag Kirby is done. We're done with that. <laughs> Stage clear! <laughs> We're getting worse and worse when it comes to uh, saving hidden waddledees, though. <laughs> A needless. So 
So on to the next region here, which is looking to be the Concrete Isles. Move closer to my microphone here too. The Concrete Isles, let's do it. Let's do it. Oh no, my cat is deciding to come back. Hi Goomba. You can just lay down though. You can it's fine. You are comfortable. It looked comfortable. You can Oh my god, he, this dude just serpentined me. Scare that seagull away. I'm not liking these dudes. These little squid guys. There we go. <laughs> These enemies feel more powerful here, and I'm not here for it. So this is clearly a, uh, the main objective here is to just collect these gems, right? We need one more now. <laughs> and this guy's got it. Is that all, all was needed? Oh, we got a fat stack of coinage. Drift down there gently. Boom. So the first, so that was just to hit or to uh, secure that first Waddle D. Try to crack open this nut. Jeez. My cat is licking himself. And the back of his neck is on my microphone, so if you see my microphone wiggling right now, it's because of my cat. Goomba. Goomba. Stop it, dude. Chill. Must you be a menace, a scourge to my, uh, my gameplay session? Okay, so wait. So how do I... Oh, duh. We're doing drilling. Okay, that's pretty nifty. Excavator Kirby? Ah, oh, just drill. Drill Kirby. Okay, now what? I don't really want this Drill Kirby anymore. Like, at all. You know what I should have done? I should have dropped my previous power-up before picking this one up. Then I could have picked it back up. Mistakes were definitely made. Oh, but that's kind of cool. Yeah, no, it's useless in the water, but. So I guess I'm going over here, to the left here. That's what it seems like, right? <laughs> okay. So I just have to make sure that uh, my cat licking himself is not gonna. Oh, you know what? Ooh, baby. Go a full Monty Mole. And, uh... Oh, the nut. The nut got sucked up. Um... Yeah, I was just making sure that my... Cat licking himself was not gonna be recorded. The audio. So, I do apologize if in this recording... You hear, like, a... It's my cat. I can't control what he does, obviously. He's a menace. Ooh, get wrecked. I like uh, how Kirby can, like, go up against foes that are, like... Like, this mole over there was, like, was, like, born doing this. And yet, I can whoop his butt. And I just learned how to do this, like, five minutes ago. 
And by five minutes ago, I mean like 30, oops, like 30 seconds ago. Like there's no reason Kirby should be able to out dig a mole. Like this is literally what the mole does. <laughs> I want to say for a living, but like that's stupid. But, like, you know what I'm saying. It's literally... It's literally all a mole is. And all, all a mole does. Alright, so anyway. Mouthful mode. Okay, so we got... <clears throat> boom. And then B is to lower it? Yeah. Spit? Question mark? Oh, yeah. Alright, so we're missing one, though. We're missing the middle... The middle gem. So where do we think that's at? Over here, maybe? Oh, crap. I would be willing to... That money is right here. Yeah, there it is. Big money. Oh, get out of here, you stupid little squid thing. There's another hidden Waddle D. Bada bing, bada boom. Two out of four saved. I was going to say, so does it... I wasn't paying attention. Is it going to... Uh, like, if I... Like, that one was the second the second hid, hidden Waddle D. Does that actually mean that that was the second... Hidden Waddle Dee in the level, and that there are two more, or is it just. Is that just the second one I found? Like, will it tell me, like. Alright, there we go. Like, with these, if you missed, like, the middle one, right? It told you, like, hey, you missed the middle one explicitly. And it can kind it kind of tells you, like, to go back. You know, you have to backtrack. If you hit one, if you hit one, and you realize the one before it, uh, you haven't got yet. You have, you know, you have to backtrack. Whereas, uh, if it's just telling you, you know, you missed one period, then it makes it a little bit more difficult. You don't know where it's gonna be. Boom, baby. <laughs> All right, mouthful pipe mouth. Oh, got a jump. Okay, this is news to me. There it is. Okay, cartoon violence. Oh yeah, gotta love it. E ton, E ten plus. This is what we get. This is what we get for our money. Okay, yeah. So it does. So I missed one. So if I want to go back, in order to get that Waddle Dee that I missed, I have to go back. <laughs> oh, jeez. I was gonna say I need this. So I already got that, right? Jeez. I don't. I don't think I care that much to get that other Waddle Dee though. As crappy as that may sound. Um Yeah, I don't really care. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna keep pushing forward. Oh no, dude. Well, Oh, no! That was just bad timing on my part. I just want this drill back. It is the end of the level, so it doesn't really matter, but I don't really want to start the next level with nothing. I'm not I'm not super fond of the, uh, of the drill, but it's better than nothing, so. <laughs> greet three seabirds. And I, I think by greet them, it just means, like, scare them away, because I had scared that seagull away, the one in the early... The early happenings of the stage. Alrighty. 
<laughs> Scale the cement summit. I just want to see. There's this one, and then there's. Oh, yeah. So this one's kind of a shorter world, it seems like. Let's scale the cement summit, shall we? 